The first thing we need to do is to have our data displayed in rows and columns. It could be on this structure or it could also be on this other structure. Um, either way would work. I'm going to show you two methods. So let's get started. We want to select first um, from cell B2 up to cell C9. Then I'm going to go up here to the insert menu and I'm going to go to the chart section. I will look for the waterfall chart and I'm going to click it. All right. I have my waterfall chart ready, but it is not showing what I want to see because I want to see how the different elements of the price keep adding up together um, to finally reach a total list price. So what I want to do is to click on the list price right here. You might have to click it twice and then you can right click over it and look for the set as total option. Okay, and after you click it, you can see that the waterfall chart displays exactly what you want to see. Um, for example, here we start with the cost of goods sold at $5.95. Then, if I add the profit of $4.81, I get a, pro a rough value of $11. And this keeps on adding the freight, the insurance, the rebates, uh, probably a discount. And all of those items add together to give me a final list price of 1313. Okay, so that's how you do a waterfall chart. Now, for the second method, you might want to select your data again. And then I'm gonna use this quick analysis tool. All right, I'm gonna look for the charts option here, and I'm gonna click on more. So this will bring me a pop-up window. I'm going to look for the All Charts tab here. And I'm going to look for the Waterfall chart, which is down here. OK. And then I'm going to click OK. And there we go. It's the same chart, but it still doesn't look exactly the same until I do the same process I did before with the list price. So um, in this other method, you can click the chart and you can go up here to the format section. You can click it and then look for the format selection. And this is going to bring up the right panel here. And you can also click now the list price. OK, you might have to click it twice and then where it says serious options you can click on this icon right here all right and then look for the for the set as total checkbox so after you click it the list price becomes the grand total so um there you go you have the waterfall chart ready in a different video i'm going to show you how to format it all right, I hope that video was helpful to you. If it was, please remember to like and subscribe. It doesn't cost you anything and you'll be supporting entrepreneurship in Central America and motivating me to make more videos. Thanks again and see you next time.